Before going to the next step, I'll explain you the difference between the named imports and default imports. Here you can see I imported the input area from the components because here I have imported exported it as a default one. So this is called default imports. When you export something as a default, you can import it as a default one. But if you didn't export this as a default one, so let me show you the named export. So you have to enclose this inside a curly brace. Yeah, now I have exported it, but it is a named export and you can see here does not contain a default export, it throws an error because in the app.jss file I tried to import a default import but it is not there it's a named import so here also we need to enclose this inside a curly brace and once I do like this you can see now if I just save oh sorry yeah now you can see it has been compiled successfully and if I go to the browser I still got the same things right so this is a small difference between the named import and export and the default import and export.